How to put audiobooks on iPod without iTunes. The steps required to add audiobooks to iPod are similar to the ones for an iPhone. It is also very common to listen to audiobooks on an iPod, simply due to its convenience. Walter Pro remains the perfect solution for this task as it supports every single generation of iPods out there. Let's download A Tale of Two Cities by Charles Dickens to be sure Walter Pro works for iPods as well. And now, just follow these three quick steps. Step 1. Launch Walter Pro and connect an iPod. Plug your iPod in using a USB cord. If you have an iPod Touch, you can connect your device via Wi-Fi. Step 2. Drag and drop. Pick your file from a finder or a desktop. Drop it into Walter. Wait for several seconds. Step 3. Play M4B on iPod. After you see Transfer Complete, you can listen to an audiobook. If you have an iPod Touch, open a default iBooks app and go to the Audiobooks section. On an iPod Nano, go to the Music app and scroll down to Audiobooks. As you see, Walter Pro automatically transfers all your files to the appropriate default app. Walter Pro is a great option if you want to transfer the audiobook from computer to iPod without iTunes. It doesn't matter which format you choose, as Walter Pro supports all. Obviously, if you choose to add M4B audiobooks to your iPhone, you will get all the benefits mentioned in our M4B versus MP3 comparison. Congrats! You've just learned how to transfer and add audiobooks to iPod without iTunes Sync. Basically, any iOS device can accept and sync audiobooks from computer thanks to Walter.